Welcome to another Digimedia Dude Tips video tutorial. I'm Marcelo Lewin, the Digimedia Dude. In this episode, I'm going to show you how to sync your external audio with your video in Adobe Premiere Pro CC. So here we are in Adobe Premiere Pro CC 2015, which is the version that I own. And as you can see, I have a couple of audio files and I have a couple of video files. Now these video files were shot with the Canon 7D and the external audio was recorded with the Zoom H5n. Now I know that this audio, the 01, goes with the 2613 and the 02 goes with the 2614. What we want to do now is we want to synchronize the new audio from the external recorder, which is the good audio, with the video which was recording audio through Canon 7D's mic, which of course is very poor quality. However, you always want to record the audio in your video recording device because Adobe Premiere Pro will use that as its sync audio to match the new audio against. The way to do this is you're going to go into your project and you're going to select your audio. Then you're going to hit the command key and select your video. Once you've done that, you're going to right click and click on Merge Clips. Here's where you get to name your new Merge Clips. So we're going to call it TNT, which is my Tech News Tuesday show on YouTube. Merged. And I'm going to say old audio removed and I'll explain what that is in a minute. Now there are five ways to synchronize. Today I'm showing you how to do it via audio. Now when you select audio, if your audio has multiple tracks, you're going to select which track will be your master track. Under audio, you can remove the audio from the video clip or you can keep it. That's the audio that is within your video clip. So in this case, since I'm doing all audio removed, I'm going to go ahead and leave this check, remove audio from AV clip. We'll click on OK. Now I'm not going to do any editing here to speed things up. This is actually doing it live and you can see it's done. Now I'm going to do it again. I'm going to select both. I'm going to say Merge Clips. And then this time I'm going to call it TNT Merged Keep Old Audio so you can see the difference. I'm going to go ahead and deselect remove audio from AB clip and click on OK. Now again, look at how fast this actually does it. It's done. So what it does is it creates two new clips. Here's the one with the old audio kept and the other one with the old audio removed. So I'm going to go ahead and select the keep all audio and I'm going to create a new sequence from it. And there it is. There's the sequence. I'm going to press play somewhere in the middle. To Tech News Tuesday. Real Tech... Welcome to Tech... So there you go. It's actually playing all the tracks. Now, let me make this a little larger so you can see. The tracks in blue are from the video. The track in green is the external source. So let's go ahead and mute the video audio tracks and press play. Welcome to Tech News Tuesday. Real technology headlines with made up inflammatory. So there you go. Now you can see that it's perfectly synced. Now let's go ahead and get the old audio removed clip and create a new sequence out of that one. And there you go. Now you see that it's actually showing only the new track. It actually removed the audio from the video and replaced it with the audio of the external source. Let's press play. Welcome to Tech News Tuesday. Real technology headlines with made up and fun. Perfectly sync. So if you tell it to remove the audio, it'll replace it with the new audio. If you say keep the audio, then you'll have all three tracks and then you can just mute them. I hope you found this episode helpful. If you did, please click on the like or thumbs up button. If you have any questions, comments, or opinions, please comment below. And like always, remember to subscribe to my channel, Digimedia Dude, to get notified when new episodes are out. Until the next one, I'm Marcelo Lewin, the Digimedia Dude. Cheers, everyone.